Okay, Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to all of you. So today I would like to share with you a short briefing video on how we are going to prepare ourselves before we enter in the online examinations. So as we know that we are undergo the online examination for final examination and also for test. So we will use Cisco Webex as a platform for us to undergo the online examination. So as we know that we will undergo test two and also the final examination in online, and we will use we will use Cisco Webex, and we will update to you in Elip whether we will change the platform or not. But as for now, we are going to use Cisco Webex as a platform for our online examination. So before we are going uh, further, I would like to explain to all of you the guideline that been prepared by our UPFK Unit Perperiksaan Fakulti Kejutra. So I will share with you a short briefing from UPFK. As you can see here, this is the UPFK Unit Perperiksaan Fakulti Kejuteraan Online Examination Instruction to Student. So the first. Please check your ELIP page for details of your online examination, whether it's using Zoom, Microsoft Team, or Webex platform. And then you must check your date and also your time exactly. Alright. The second one, please check your session access code and also invigilator's names. Then student will be allocated to different session and invigilated by different invigilator because we know that the room for examination in online. The maximum number will be 20 person or 20 pax per online examination. The third one, examination question will be uploaded in Elite by course coordinator on the schedule at dates and times. So please make sure to log in to your Elite every time and please ensure that the question during the online exam are uploaded in your Elite. So if they are not uh, uploaded, so contact your coordinator urgently and make sure that you have your course coordinator contact number available to prior to before your examination okay the fourth one make sure you log in 30 minutes before the online examination starts because this uh, we will use this 30 minutes allocation times for your qr attendance and you need to fill in your full name and metric number when, before you entering the webex or zoom or Microsoft Teams. So you need to rename your name uh, on Webex user as um, let's say your name is Muhammad Azrin. You so you put your name Muhammad Azrin dash your metric number. Let's say your metric number is three four one seven four. So you just write down Muhammad Azrin dash your metric number. And before that, you need to also to fill in your online accessibility and integrity declaration form, and you need to upload it. And you need to upload in Elite. So make sure there are links so you can upload your submit your online accessibility and integrity declaration form before your examination start. While you start answering your question, as soon as the SDs are uploaded in Elite, so please check whether your course coordinator beforehand on submitting your answer, whether you need to key in directly in Elite or you can also by write down on the paper and snapshot the answer and then this uploaded into the submission link in Elite. All right. Then after you finish your answering your questions, so you need to ensure that you submit the answer and click submit button. Then you are not allowed to lock off when the invigilate uh, only you, you are not a lock off you are not allowed to log off until the end of the session of examination. If the examination is taking for 3 hours, so you need to wait for 3 hours. If you finish earlier, you need to wait and then you are not allowed to log off. Log off only when the individual letters and the session. Whether we are using Zoom, Microsoft Teams or also Webex session, all will be recorded. So please ensure that you are on, switch on your camera. So, and mute your mic or you only allowed to unmute your mic when you are having a questions you want to ask to the invigilators. But if you are, uh, while, you are while you are answering the question, you need to switch on every single minute, every time. Okay. 
So make sure you are on your computer, your web computer, or you can use either uh, such as your phone as a computer, as a webcam. So we can see you. And the format is we want to see your face and we want to see you writing your answer. Okay. So please make sure you do not lock off the session even after you are you have submitted your full answer to Elite. Okay. Wait until the invigilator and the session. And last one, all questions are confidential in nature and must not be shared with other person and or only in any other media. So infringements of these rules will lead to serious disciplinary action toward the student. So please make sure, please make sure that you really follow the requirement and also the rules that being prepared by the UKFK. So now I would like to share with you the the form that you need to fill in before your examination. So I think your coordinator already give uh, gave to you this uh, online accessibility and integrity declaration form. So you need to fill in by writing your name. Okay, your metric numbers, your course name, and also your course code, and then you need to signature and then put your date before your examination. And if you finish uh, writing all the information here and details, so you need to submit this form in Elite by using the submission that given by your coordinator. So make sure that you are submitted before you entering the online station. If you fail to submit this online accessibility and integrity declaration forms, mean you are not allowed to entering your online examination. Okay guys, so I will share with you uh, Elite uh, Unimas.my so where, the, where you need to entering your Elite uh, for KNF1013 Engineering Mathematics 1. So going, uh, you scroll until you, you find the information for your test 2, okay? Alright, so below there, you can see that the uh, test 2 online uh, information, so the date will be on 23rd July 2020, which is Thursday, and the time is 1 to 2 p.m. which is one hour examination which is test 2 and you must be ready early 12 30 because we want to uh, get your QR code QR attendance and also we want you to submit your online accessibility for test 2 uh, declaration for form for test 2 and we want you to we want to uh, undergo some tests uh, you need to switch on your computer switch on your uh, uh, camera and so on so you need to prepare early. So we 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 will use the Webex platform. Okay. So topic cover is differentiation integration. So uh, here also there are Webex test to online examination room for TS Mamajin. You can see there are sixteen person. Okay, the maximum number is 20. So this is the uh, room for TS Mama Azrin with the meeting numbers and also the password. And this is uh, the room for Dr. Tay. So it is 17 person, which is uh, okay. So you need to check your name, where are you are located, allocated to which room. And then also your uh, meeting numbers and password. And also, there are, there are also a submission link. You need to submit your online accessibility integrity declaration form before your online examination. Okay, here. And then you need also to click this link to enter it, to enter the Webex session room for allocated, uh, uh, for allocated one. Eh? Okay. Then the third one, question test two online KNF. So you click this for entering the question and the question will be uh, available only on the time given, which is 1 until 2 p.m. Okay, so you need also to submit the answer within that time in this uh, question uh, question link. Okay, there will be a link there. Uh, when you click the, this question, there will be question and you can submit your answer by snapshot you do in your on your paper then you snapshot and then submit while you are 
when you finish your uh, answering okay if within one hour you are not ready to submit or you are missed to submit in this link so we are given to you 15 minutes only to submit for those who are and this is as a backup so i want all of you maybe you need all of you to submit here also so we can give you a mark from here and also from this link okay i think this is the most important that you need to know the first one is your name and your room and also your details and your meeting numbers and also your password and also the link here down here uh, down here okay and you need to prepare yourself uh, for the topic that covered is differentiation and integration okay you can study the implicit uh, differentiation okay you can study the sign cost trigonometry differentiation you can study also the stationary point to sketch the graph and also you can study about the rate of change and so on oh, and, and also for integration you may study the scalar multiplication and sums rule that you have have learned right and also your linear composite uh, composite rules and also the pass fraction and 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 all the subject that you have learned in your integration okay so make sure you do a study before you are entering your final exam and you are not allowed to cheat in your examination okay <coughs> okay so please ensure that you are really ready because you need to ready your internet access and also your computer and also your phone to snap your answer and also we need to see you your face okay so i stop share screen first okay so that is the thing that you need to prepare and you need to know before you enter your online examination so i hope that my explanation and also my briefly uh, instruction can get you to ready your online examination and also there will be a revision maybe by your own lecturer and also please uh, prepare your equipment okay your equipment for examination your pen your mark your liquid your papers and also your laptop or your computer with camera and also your phone ready before your examination okay so i think that's all for me to share with you this short video on how we are going to undergo our online examination all of you to be ready and i wish you all good luck and all the best so please do well and please not cheat in your online examination okay so until we meet in our online examination so stay tuned stay good stay safe and assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh